Hey guys, welcome back. So about to dive into another episode of Attack on Titan. This is episode 47 of season 3. Friends, it's the episode. So we just finished episode 46, The Rule of the War, where the big titan, Rod, basically got to the wall and was pretty much breaking his way in. But then the troops blasted him full of holes with the cannon and blew him up. But not before he revealed himself like quite grotesquely having his face off and his whole front pretty much eviscerated and then all his entrails and guts kind of fell out over the wall. It was one of the grossest things I've ever seen. I'm a big fan of George A. Romero and Day of the Dead is an amazing zombie film. So if you've seen Night of the Living Dead and Dawn of the Dead and Day of the Dead, the original Romero trilogy, they're wonderful films. And there's a scene in Day of the Dead where a zombie is on a gurney and he kind of like sits up and just reaches for somebody and he's being cut open and everything just falls out all over the floor and very gross it was marvelous special effects and that image that we saw in that previous episode with the titan just gave me a call back to that and i was just like yuck this is gross i love it it's fantastic so without further ado do, do i do i say that too much without further ado i've been checking out some other youtubers and some of them also do that without further ado i don't know it's just a thing Let's dive into the episode. So this is episode 47. Friends. Na, 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 na. I'm sorry. So this is a Tama based reaction. As you know, you can grab your copy and watch along. Or you can go to my Patreon where you can catch the whole thing and help support my channel. Are you ready? 3, 2, 1, go. Friends. The episode with Ross and Rachel. And Chandler. Joey. Phoebe. Monica. I didn't want to leave anybody out in case they were watching. They're not watching. Okay, so they blew the fuck out of him. I think his story had killed her father. He had bits flying through the air and they were just slicing and dicing. I believe she got him. And the crowd saw her do it. So they think, hey, you're awesome. By the way, I'm your queen. And Kenny... Yeah. Oh, okay. We're building up to that reveal. So Levi confronted Kenny at the very end of the past episode and he had a syringe for the Titan transformation liquid. Uh oh. So I still think Levi is an Ackerman as well. That's going to be revealed. He's related to Mikasa. They're like cousins or something. Or aunt and uncle relationship. Who knows? So that image... That image that was... Like, I don't know who it was. Was it, um, Historia as a baby in her mother's arms with somebody that looked like Aaron's father with her? No. They all look so happy. Things aren't happy in this world, man. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, Kenny as a young man. Who's got him? Who's this? It's one of the royals. Ah, oh, okay.
shit. <laughs> I just threw a knife at you, forgive me. I can't control my creativity. A blade through the arm would hurt. Is this an underground city? Jesus Christ. What? Jeez. Oh, that's the sister. Okay, right. I knew it, so... It is your sister, right? Levi's malnourished the shit. God, man.
baby Levi. Didn't go out like my sister did. So he is an Ackerman. Nice to meet you.
And this is why he wants the power of the Titan. Hmm. Yeah, a big dumb titan. I was thinking the same thing. He's been there waiting for a while. Because he licked it off the floor. Shimon, hurry up and take that stuff. He wants Levi to do it. Uncle Kenny. What's that? Dead Kenny. Kenny's out. He didn't inject the stuff, which means Levi will have it. Ah, the coronation. Holy shit. Oh! 
Queen Historia, holy shit. It was actually very cool. Ah, she sure did. I still remember her from season one. <laughs> He's gonna punch the run in the face. <laughs> right in the ribs. What? Hey, guys. Been hot and run. It's been a while. Hey, Dawn, where's... Here he is. Damn. The coordinate. Who this? What? <gasps> The teacher guy. Right? Owen's father? I think. Shit. Beast Titan. Reiner and Bernhold. <laughs> God, the Yama Titan look all fucked up. Did they just have a fight with the Beast Titan? Is that why he was destroyed? Was... Was that the guy that we see in the opening credits with Erwin teaching? Pretty sure. Ghost hands. So Kenny died and then gave Levi a little box with something in it. Was that the the syringe? Because the syringe was open by his side and then he's just shoved something into Levi's hands. I initially thought, oh, what's in that? Something different, but it could be the, the syringe box. And then it sounded like Levi was about to say goodbye to everybody and then be done with it. So interesting. Is he on his way somewhere? Is he going to do something? And of course... Surprise cameo appearance there at the end. We didn't know I was going to get Reiner and Bernholt back. So the armor titan was laying face down or destroyed. And there was the beast titan. So we've not seen him for a good long while. Here he is. So the coordinate. 
that's what they need to get. So it's not about rescuing any at the minute, getting the coordinates so or whatever that whatever that is. And the guy who stepped out of the Beast Titan, we've seen him before. So was he like the teacher guy with Erwin? I need to watch the next episode and find out because it's about time. We need to learn who this guy is and a bit more about them. I'm surprised. I wasn't aware they were going to come into this season because they've been off book for so long. I didn't know what was going on. And to have them suddenly appear here was a, a nice surprise. Awesome. So only two episodes left for me today. I'm going to have a quick break. I've been doing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven episodes today and I'm stiff. I've got to go have a rest. Anyway, catch you next week. Thanks for watching.